This video will demonstrate how to turn multiple PDF invoices into Excel documents by using Lido. On my screen, I have three invoices that contain information related to financial consulting services. We have one for January, February, and March. These are generic invoices that I generated from templates provided by Microsoft Word. These names, dates, and titles are all generated by Word, and the only things that I changed are adding some line items for each of the different months. As I flip back and forth over these, we can see we have consulting services, logo design, software procurement, and travel, with some rates and amounts changing in the table. What I want to show you now is how easy it is to extract this information with Lido and turn it into an Excel document with very minimal work on your end. Let's now switch over to Lido, where we can see that I have one file, Invoice Extraction. Opening it up, there is currently nothing contained in it. To bring in my PDF invoices, I navigate to the PDF Tools option in the menu and select PDF Data Extractor. We are prompted with an upload modal that expects our PDFs. Let me drag in and drop just the January PDF that I displayed. I'll let this process in real time and you'll see how quickly it can collect all the information from the PDF. And it's already finished. Now that it's loaded in, we can see three fields in this extract data modal. Columns, extra instructions, and files. Working from the bottom up, in files we can see the January PDF. To add more, it's as simple as dragging and dropping in the rest. Extra instructions are instructions that we can provide Lido for some extra context in how we would like to see Lido display our data on the sheet. We will leave this input alone for now and come back to it later. The final field is columns. These are what Lido is going to display on our finalized sheet once it's done processing the files. Lido has read our PDFs and identified the following as most likely to be useful to have produced in our Excel report description, hours, rate, amount, invoice, and date. Going back to one of the PDFs, you'll notice that only description, hours, rates, and amount are contained in the table. Invoice and date are elsewhere in the PDF. Lido is smart enough to know that even though the data is not in the table, the invoice and date are likely pieces of data we care about seeing in our PDF invoice. Let's now extract all the data by hitting the Process All Files button. I'll let this run again in real time, and you'll see how quickly it can take care of that extraction for us. Perfect. After a moment of thinking, Lido produces our Excel report of all the information on the invoices that we asked for, the table contents in the first four columns, and the extra information in columns E and F. It's intelligent enough to know where there is data in the tables as well. For instance, it's only showing hours in the appropriate cell where there are hours in the PDF tables and leaving the rest blank. It's simple to modify the output. Let me delete these rows and try adding some columns. Let's see if we can additionally capture and output the month and the vendor name. Adding columns you would like to be displayed in your report is as simple as entering the value you would like to see displayed and hitting enter. Let me bring the files back into the modal by hitting these refresh buttons and process the information once again. Excellent. With that complete, we can see we have additional information in our Excel document. One final thing I would like to show you is the extra instructions field. We can supply Lido's AI model additional information about how we would like the data to be processed and displayed. For instance, Let's say I would like to have the two monetary fields, rate and amount, be displayed with a dollar sign and have commas to denote when there are thousands of dollars. I'll add this sentence. Have the rate and amount columns be formatted as monetary amounts with commas and a dollar sign. Let's also say that we don't care for whatever reason about the travel cost line items in the invoices. I'll add the following sentence. Don't include the travel costs. Let's bring our files back in with the refresh button and process them all again. Lido will do its thing and alert us when each file has been processed. And after just a moment, we can see the monetary amounts are formatted correctly and the travel costs have been removed from the line items. 
The very last thing I want to show you is how to download this file so that I have it on my computer as an Excel file. That is done by navigating to the File option and selecting Export Values to Excel. It will be saved with the file name that I provided it in Lido. So I'll go ahead and hit Save and then open up this Excel report. And just like that, we have successfully used Lido to pull our invoice data from a PDF and place it into a customized Excel document. So it's quite easy. You just open up the PDF Data Extractor tool and fill out the following fields. Columns to specify the columns you would like to see on the sheet. Extra instructions for the additional context on how you would like the data to be displayed. And files, which are all the files you would like Lido to read and extract. Lido makes it clean and easy to do this with multiple invoices all at once. Thank you for watching. Please let me know in the comments below if this was a helpful and informative video and what other features of Lido you would like to see in future videos. Do give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful as it does help others find this content. And don't forget to hit subscribe so that you know when the next video drops.